It's a Syracuse bakery known for more than its giant chocolate chip cookies. Provisions has provided job training for hundreds with mental health challenges. Unable to survive the challenges of a pandemic, Provisions is closing for good. But as News Channel 9's Adrian Smith tells us, the mission isn't ending. For over 30 years, it's been a bakery serving more than just sweet treats. Provisions has also served as a place of hope. All of our programs are really focused on helping people succeed in the community, whether that's at home, school, work, or play. And Provisions was really part of that work component, helping those who have a mental health diagnosis in their recovery by teaching them job skills so they could find more permanent employment. Like I know that the pandemic has affected so many different nonprofits and businesses throughout, but just run me through how the pandemic has led you to this decision, a very difficult one at that. The closing of provisions was such a difficult decision for us to make, and it was really, we closed our doors um, in early March, like so many other restaurants did. And our hope was that in a couple of months, we would be able to reopen. And as time went on and as the pandemic reaches its sixth and seventh month, it just became increasingly clear that that, that was not going to be an option for us. But as the saying goes, one door closes and another one opens. Access CNY will provide a new way of supporting Provisions employees with a soft skills readiness program. So we know they have the hard baking and customer service skills, but now really working on some of those soft skills, which will make them uh, more employable. So everything from work attire and hygiene to motivation, a social skills training, how to prepare an application, a resume, how to do an effective job search, and tours on other sites where they could work. Moving forward with hope still rising. In Syracuse, Adrian Smith, News Channel 9. Oh, so hard to see that bakery empty. Many will miss it.